And illegal drugs aren't supposed to find their way inside jails, but they do. The Hamilton County Sheriff has been working to find the source and stop it from happening. Angela Ingram is live now with efforts to keep the jail drug free. Hi, Angela. Hi, Cammie. There was a sweep of the jail today. Canines and their handlers went floor by floor looking for illegal contraband. And the sheriff says this is not only for the inmates, but also for the people working there. Canines from Montgomery, Blue Ash, Green Township, and the Hamilton County Sheriff's Office <laughs> team up at the Hamilton County Jail, searching for items that don't belong here. We have one heck of a, uh, uh, a team assembled here today. Um, dynamic effort to do what we can to uh, uh, secure uh, drug contraband specifically drugs. The opioid crisis is a problem outside of the facility and the sheriff is trying to stop it from coming inside. A lot of the cocktails are lethal and you know with the fentanyls uh, and we're doing what we can not only to protect the, uh, uh, the, the offenders uh, from their uh, behavior but also to protect the, the deputies and other employees that are here. In March, Satwinder Singh died from an apparent overdose in his cell. The 31-year-old faced vehicular homicide charges for allegedly hitting and killing a toddler. We'll be in and out of your hair. Just need it quiet. Denise Driehaus chairs the Hamilton County Heroin Coalition and has been working with Sheriff Neal. I th think it's extremely important to make sure that the jail is drug free, particularly because we have people in the jail who are going through treatment. We're also partnering with the retrofit in the jail. We're uh, going to have 90 additional beds for treatment in that facility come the end of the year. The sheriff says they look for other kinds of contraband as well, but drugs are high on the list of priority. The offender has 24 hours a day to think of ways of getting uh, contraband brought in. And the retrofit that will add those 90 beds for treatment at the jail is under construction right now. Denise Driehaus says the state of Ohio gave Hamilton County $2.5 million to get that work done. Reporting live from the Hamilton County Justice Center, Angela Ingram, Local 12 News. Cammie, back to you. All right, Angela, thank you. And the Hamilton County Heroin Task Force is handling the death of Satwinder Singh. Investigators are waiting for the results of testing by the coroner's office.